It's been dubbed a scientific voyage into the unknown. The CSIRO vessel departing Darwin on Friday en route to a virtually uncharted part of Australian territory, two marine parks near Christmas and Cocos Islands. It's an exciting place to go and it's almost completely unknown. Um, we know nothing about what animals live on the seafloor. We Half of it hasn't even been mapped yet. The investigator was responsible for last year's discovery of an undersea volcano near Christmas Island, dubbed the Eye of Sauron. This time, they're exploring giant deep sea mountains near the Cocos Islands. Mount Kosciuszko is only just over 2,000 metres, and these things are four or five kilometres high. In these uncharted waters, scientists are hoping for some interesting and bizarre deep sea discoveries. Down there, you've got a lot of really blobby things and a lot of really fanging things and um, some really, um, really, really cool deep sea animals. There's 53 people on board the vessel for its 35 day journey. And during that time, they'll also be video chatting with school students to talk about the voyage. They love the whole idea of life on the ship as well as what kind of cool equipment we use and what kind of animals we might see. And it's not just students who might learn a thing or two. And it's always just really exciting to be able to show Australians what Australians marine resources look like, what you're, what's under the waves really. A voyage of discovery in a little explored part of the ocean. Mitchell Abram, ABC News, Darwin.